Good evening! This is that one guy broadcasting from Dark Outside Holland. Tonight, my buddy and roommate, West Block, uh, he wants to do a little survival series on Suryor being hunted. Rather than starting his own YouTube channel, he's decided to piggyback on mine. I'll give him his own playlist and a bunch of credit. If he does well enough, I'll set him up with his own YouTube channel and all of the stock footage that doesn't get deleted put that thing down. Anyways, to West Block. Hi folks, this is West Block, broadcasting from Holland. Thanks to that one guy. Okay, so, Sir You Are Being Hunted, I discovered it through my good friend, that one guy, and it's a lot of fun. One of the most uh, interesting survival uh, slash horror uh, games I've played in quite a long time. Um, definitely has a lot of elements which I'll kind of be going through, and uh, you all can watch and kind of watch, laugh as I derp around a little bit, but uh, hopefully you get a sense of what this game's like, and I hope you... Uh, get to try it out sometime. It's really fun. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, start a new world. So the way this works is uh, you have a, a world that generates. So uh, it's called procedural generation according to that one guy. So I'm going to go ahead and hit build new world. It's a bit like Minecraft in that way. So here you see you've got uh, all the uh, different islands and so you're on this archipelago with five islands. And archipelago. Archipelago, whatever. Anyway. The point is, you have five islands, and you get to choose what the environment is. Now, it's nice to have a different one for each, so I'm going to go through and say industrial. The last one, I'm going to say is... Yeah, I got a fence. Let's see. Uh, mountain. Okay, there we go. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, I'll go... I'll go like this. This is cool. All right, so hit build, and then the game is going to generate the world. And it's cool. So yeah, we're gonna see this happen. All right. So, if you can Scary hear this, time. then the experiment has gone terribly wrong. I Ooh. fear you may be trapped on the archipelago, but don't panic. Archipelago. The standing stones <laughs> should be nearby. With them and some luck, you may still be able to escape. Listen very carefully. Oh, I'm listening. And you might just survive. I'm afraid pieces of the device are now scattered across the islands. They became quite hot during the experiment. So perhaps you could look for the smoke. Bring any you find back to the standing stones. Then we should be able to get you home. I'm dreadfully sorry, sir, but this does mean postponing dinner preparations. I do hope you remember to eat something. You must try to keep your strength up. Perhaps some so very tea British. and biscuits from one of the nearby houses? The residents won't mind because they're... Well, they're not at home. Oh, and do be careful, sir. You're being hunted. <laughs> So creepy. All right, here we go. And so now we are loading up. And these are the standing stones that were mentioned in the introduction. Um, these are kind of where you bring all the pieces you need to find. You can save your progress here. Um, while I have the screen open, I'll show you a few things. Inventory is right here, and these are your equip slots uh, over on the right. Uh, and let's see, current items that, uh, that you're using is going to show up in this circular area on the bottom right of your screen, which also shows any rounds or ammunition you have for any weapons you might find. Now the left hand has a visibility meter, so you know uh, how visible you are at any given time. Your health is your bodily well-being, but your vitality is your stamina or um, endurance, I guess. And vitality you can improve by eating stuff, which we'll find out in a minute what we can eat. Uh, but health... Health only goes back up if your vitality's at a good place. And if you don't eat enough, you can starve to death. And if you get shot, for example, which you will also see what I mean in a bit, that will go down steadily if you're bleeding. Uh, so keep an eye on that. Bandages are good for stopping bleeding. All right, without further ado, let's keep exploring. Examine this with the F key. This is a robot. Oh, and this is what's hunting us, unfortunately. 
I don't want the jack-o'-lantern, but I do want the binoculars. These are an equipable item, so double-click on those to put it in my inventory. There's a canned pie, the bottle, and more bandages. Now, uh, I'll show you how these things work as I have opportunity to use them. important part is I'm going to equip these both, actually these three. And there we go. I'm scared now. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Uh, why do we have a cello? That's that's uh, that's fair. Okay. Ye what? No. Why would I do that? Being informative, we don't do that around here. Anyway, okay. So the whole point, or of this game, besides actually staying alive, is to collect these. So you get the mysterious fragments, and on each island, there's a certain number. So thank you for that. And uh, yeah, there's about four or five on any given island. Nine on the center, and I'm on the center island. Yeah, there we go. A few more of those, and we can activate the device. Activate it. Boy, I don't know what is it with British people and having excellent voices. All right, cool. So I have a piece now, but not all the pieces are that close to me. So, oop, that, ladies and gentlemen, is a balloon. And it's coming towards me, and I don't want it to. See, hold on, I'll pull up binoculars really quick. See that guy? Well, that guy is a bastard. He spots you, and that spotlight he's got there, he shines it on you and alerts every other hunter in the area to your whereabouts. That's no bueno. So we're going to go over here towards this house. All right, so important places in this game, keeping an eye on the balloon. Uh, this is probably one of your best friends right here. And this is probably your best friend. The tall corn stuff on the other side of this fence, that's really good for hiding in, for losing your hunters. Now you might be saying, what in the world is a hunter, West Block? Well, I'll tell you. They kind of look like that guy, but you can't really see him too well. So I'll, I'll tell you when I see one. But that, he's going towards the house. I'm going to have to wait till he goes. Let's see. Ah, there's a hunter. See that guy moving over there? He's carrying a shotgun, and if he sees me, he's going to try and kill me. Apparently, all of them just decide to kill me. The robotic arms. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Is he past that? Almost. I can start heading over that way now. Okay. Um, in this game, you can press shift to sprint if you need to. It makes you much more visible and much more loud. So don't necessarily do that. Um, see the sun's going down? That means nighttime soon. And nighttime means I'm less visible, which is great. The balloon won't see me. He just kind of goes around, and if he happens to land right on top of me, then he'll alert everybody. But I'm going right over here because I'm pretty sure he's going to go the other way. Of course, if I'm wrong, that's going to be terrifying. All right, so we loot doors. Uh, apparently, we don't go into the house. We just press F when we come up to a door and seal all what's inside. So the T is good. The rock I can use as a distraction to throw it. Same with the bottle. Uh, the alarm clock you can set, and it makes a lot of noise after a couple seconds. You've seen the binoculars already. This stuff, the things that say dubious, they don't help you, they hurt you. Some dubious stuff will help you, but eh. There are indeed mushrooms. You can, you can trip out if you want to. Um, dead rats are no good. And then there are things that just are junk. So I'm just going to go away. A uh, random song brought to you by that one guy. Uh, pickled eggs. Interesting. Not come across those. So yeah, th at the moment, what I'm doing right now is just trying to get as much stuff as I can before I go looking for pieces. Uh, this item, you might want to get. Don't. Don't do that. Be because uh, the torch not illuminates your pathway, but you can see pretty well at night. And the, the really unfortunate bit is that it will leave you very, very uh, exposed. Ah, um, matches! Hooray! Drop of sherry. Good. All right, so I'm, I'm decently well equipped right now. I can go searching, probably. Um, there's the standing stones. Now, do I see any smoke? It's kind of hard to tell. It's really foggy. There's a moth. Let's see. I'm going to look. Well, there's a... I do not have a map, unfortunately. You can find maps. There's that balloon. I'm going to head towards this uh, 
farmhouse looking dealy. Because it looks like it's on a bit of an elevation. I'm going to scout the territory. One of the things I love about this game is that I've I've seen people get pretty far. I've gotten decently far myself, gotten a few things. And at no point do I ever feel like the hunter. It's You can definitely feel a little more well prepared. But the excellent horror element of this game is that it's just you can't really take control of the situation. It's all about being sneaky. Oh, speaking of which, I hit control. And going to duck down and get away. This is a little bit scary, but there's only one of them as far as I can tell. That... Ooh. I don't think I saved. Uh-oh. I'm... I'm... Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of in trouble right now. I'm trying to tell if he's just preparing... patrolling the area. Where's that balloon? There's two of them there. Okay. Oh, three. So, so this is what I'm scared of, guys. These things wander around, sometimes in single groups, sometimes in packs, and they have an uncanny ability to be exactly where you don't want them to be. But they look like they're going away, so I'm just going to kind of poke my head around the corner, and here we go. Okay. Cool. Now I get to explore a little bit. But I have to be careful, because if that balloon finds me, those guys are close. No, no sign. I don't really know what these things are. Apparently, according to that one guy, that's a watchtower. And there is... I can't see anything, but it looks like it's pretty abandoned, so... Alright. There's a church! There's more tall grass, that's good. Uh, I'm going to head over towards the church. Now I'm in the corn stuff, and as you see on my visibility meter on the bottom left, nobody can see me! Ah, da, 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 I'm walking through the corn. Alright. Okay, and I'm sneaking, and I'm sneaking. And I don't see anybody. See, the temptation right now is just to stand up and go, but I would not give in to that at any point in this game, because they're everywhere, and just because you can't see them doesn't mean they can't see you. The AI in this game is actually pretty, pretty annoying. It's, it, the robots are not dumb. If you pop up and they see you, and you go back to ground, and they can't see you, they're not just going to turn away like, uh, nothing happened. They're going to come find you. They're going to look in the last place they saw you. I hear something. What? It's kind of a Ah, uh, okay. There's another hunter. Oh, there's oh, there's white sir. there's white smoke. So that's two guys by some stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna go check out in here. Oh, let's see. Oh, my vitality's getting a little low, but I I I'm keeping an eye on it. I'm gonna stand up. Let's see. This is a grave. Gone forever. Daz Tims. Poor Daz Tims. Wait. I hear something. Is this a door? Yes, it would. But it would also get me killed in the wrong situation. So, balloon? Balloon? No? What's that? It is a farmhouse I just came from. Hooray, I'm good at this game. That's what I meant by derp around, guys. Oh, more. That's, there's an actual town. There's the artifact. Those guys are kind of wandering around. i got to be careful. But... The, see, they're kind of smart. They know what I'm looking for. So I'm going to crouch down and be kind of slow. They know what's up. They're not stupid. But they, fortunately, there's tall grass nearby. And I can... Let's see. These are some town buildings, I guess. It looks like there's corn beyond it, so I'm going to have, probably have to circle around. Let's see. Are there front doors to this place? I don't see anything like. Alright. This is hard to get into. Huh. I know, right? What an odd place. Anyway, okay, so. Fruitless, literally. Fruitless search. I hear hunters. And that's the most annoying part is they kind of do this thrumming noise that gets in your brain after a little while, makes you paranoid, kind of jump at your own shadow. The other thing that the hunters do is, you 
you go to bed afterwards and you think you hear them. It's terrible. I had that last night. Let's see. I'm gonna get behind this wall and just kind of crouch walk along it. Yes, that looks like a town over there. And I, I'm going to investigate it. There's is this corn right here? This is. I'm not gonna hop the fence. As long as I stay behind this fence, I should be okay. No, they're right next to me. They're right next to me. No, I should not. That one guy is is trying to get me killed because he wants to uh, do something funny. But the the odds are in this game that I'm probably going to die at some point too because I'm going right. Ugh, that was scary. I just like hit a little rise. Okay, I did not. Let's see. I'm gonna use some tea and go back up to full vitality, which is great. All right. As that one guy kindly keeps reminding me, I did not save yet. Proof of how amazingly excellent I am at this game. So here's a gate thing. No, not a gate. It looked like a, looked like a gate. It was not a gate. I was deceived. There's a gate. Okay, hunters. None. Okay, good. All right. I, as far as I can tell, I'm good. Balloon, balloon. No, no, no balloon. Okay, good. That makes me a happy camper. All right. So, carrying on. I don't see anybody. Oh, time to drop back down. Scary. Ah, good. A few doors to pick. I'm just gonna keep down because that hedge is concealing me from those two buggers by the other artifact. This and absolutely nothing. Not a useful thing in there, but there are more doors, so we're going to keep walking around this structure. Yes, one does not simply walk into more doors. There's a gas lamp there, which makes me very nervous, because where there are gas lamps... Yes, I want to eat mothballs. No, I do not. <clears throat> Indeed. What, what, what's this? I don't hear anybody. Is that a crow? Oh... If I scare that guy, he's going to go taking off and alerting them to everyone. No, no. All right. All right. Good enough. I think that was a colony of rats, guys. All right. I can stand up. If there are no bots around here, I can I can loot the town. Whoa, rotting beef. No thanks. No torch. Yeah, it was. Unfortunately, it would probably kill me if I ate it. Jar of marmalade! And more bandages, great, because I'm about to go do something really silly. Uh, that seems like a good idea, I guess. I think... What is this? Uh, that is indeed a wall. I'm good at this game, guys. As I've said before, just follow my example and you'll survive until whenever. Well, that's not a good thing. Those guys might have seen the birds go flying, so I'm going to go take a sneak over this way. Yeah, I hear them. Uh, other guys coming at me from other ways? Nope. Uh, I'm scared, guys. This is Ted Creepies. Okay. Honestly, during the day. I, I, I'm more... I'm That one guy is asking me if I'm more scared during the day or night in this game. And I am actually much more scared during the day because it's so much easier for them to see me. Okay, there's my objective. That white smoke over yonder. Yeah. My current objective, should I say. As there are plenty more for me to find, but... So, is this game open world? Let's see. So yeah, guys, this this is definitely not uh, your run-of-the-mill kind of linear place. You can go almost wherever. I mean, there's there's definitely things that draw you, but you this is a massive, massive world. Oh, okay, what's this now? Oh, 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 oh. There's there's there is a big fat guy over there wearing a bowler and two guys wearing a top hat, and they're kind of coming this way. No, not really though. I think I can just go this way and go around this hedge. But I hear bots. And it's daytime, and if I go around this corner and run smack dab into one, I'm going to be so screwed. Let's see. 
Okay, so far so good. Oh, there they are. There is. I think if I go around here. Nope. That looks like a big N.O. Looks like I'm going to have to go up the road. Let's see. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, so... Let's see. Okay, so, okay, so, okay, so. Indeed. No, I, I actually have to get going in about 20 minutes. Let's see. Okay, there's the church. Smoke? Smoke? Oop! Okay! Yep, there they are. Yeah, it is, unfortunately. They can totally see me if I move. Oh! Oh! They just saw me! Frig me! Frig me! Okay. Frig me! So this is the part where I run. And go to ground again. Where are they? They're following me, and that much is for sure. I'm working on it. Finding safe. They just laughed at me! Fuck! Go oh, get them! <laughs> I'm getting shot, guys! This is scary. Okay. Tall grass. Tall grass. Okay. H. Press H, and you get bandaged. And then your health goes back up. Alright, they're following me, and so they're not by the artifact. Frick me! Frick me! Frick me! Okay. No, 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 no. Okay. Damn it! Damn it! No, no, Stop, 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 stop. Okay. I am very fortunate. I have another bandage, but I gotta run. Oh, crap! <laughs> I am so dead. I am dead. No. I'm alive right now, but not for long, because I'm stuck. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Do they still see me? I don't know if they still see me or not, guys. Holy shit! They do! They do! Hug me! Ah! No, 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 no. No, no. Oh god. Oh god, there's more of them. God, no! No! No, 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 no. Hug me! This is so freaking terrifying, guys. You have no idea. Run me! Save me! No, 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 no! Stop it! Stop chasing me, you bastards! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, 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 no. I don't. I, where's tall grass? Where's tall grass? I need. I need you. Uh. All right. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I don't know if they still see me or not, guys. I can hear them, so I'm just gonna keep going through the tall grass. Oh, guys, I'm scary. Okay. How did that happen? All right. So. No, I, I did. I looted bandages all the way along, huh? Okay. Where are they? Guys, I don't know how I survived that. They're all by the farmhouse. Okay. They've lost interest. Oh shoot, guys. That was that was that was that was kind of the reason why this game is terrifying, because oh, okay. Oh man. Um yeah, I have to get back to the tall stone, so I can actually save save this game. I need to save this game. Okay. Okay. Oh wait, this is the church. I've gone in a big circle. Okay. There we go. Okay, the circle on your compass, guys. I can't. I pointed at the screen. See, I'm bad at this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, the circle on my north side of my compass. Let's see. See, I, I can show you with my mouse. There you go. Up there. Um, Anything else I need to equip? No, I'm good. Uh, my vitality is... Okay, my health's going back up. I do not see any robots. I just heard somebody shoot at me, though. No, dude, they don't, they don't necessarily shoot at uh, you. They sometimes just pop shots to try and get you to run. Sometimes the robots apparently like to just shoot randomly to in order to make me run. And I, I tell you what, it's a fairly effective strategy because I'm scared as piss right now. <laughs> I don't see them, though. Anyways, yeah, that's a fire if you want to try and cook something. Hi. You know, Let's see. A campfire in the vicinity. Turn to your left. Your left. No, left. Uh, that thing right 
Aha! This right here, gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. This is a campfire. I could cook something, but pickled eggs... Pickled eggs aren't great cooked, and neither is sherry. So, I'm gonna go back and save the game. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anybody. There's a shed. Sheds are good. Um, there were some guys patrolling up this way, so I'm gonna keep my eyes... <laughs> Speaking of which, running now! I heard a drink! That usually means they see me, so I'm gonna run towards the stones and save before they blow my head off. Save progress, ladies and gentlemen. Oh shit! Excellent. Oh. We're making progress. We're making progress, my ass! Progress and die. Okay, since so that one guy has really been wanting to do something, I'm gonna go hug this robot. Hi, guy! There we go. That's what it looks like when you die. <laughs> if you can't hear him, he's playing taps. Or trying to, on a cello. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. You appear to be dead. Th this game, guys. Seriously. It it's so much fun. Tea drunk. There's even a stats for tea drunk. That's amazing. Instead of food eaten. Okay, so... Robots are all bitches. Th that's the... That's the... Having fun? Yes. Anyway, I didn't know you played cello. I've never, I've never seen it. I, I need to subscribe to your channel. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. It was a good time. I may be back. And yeah, this is West. <laughs> this is West Block signing off. That one guy is intensely amused by this. Yeah. <laughs>